All right. Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, learn HTML by building a cat photo app. Step 57. All right. So now we're going to add the name attribute with the value personality to the checkbox input element. All right. So while we won't notice this in the browser, doing this makes it easier for a server to process our web form, especially when there are multiple checkboxes. All right. So, so, so we're going to give this thing a personality, a, uh, what was it? A name of personality. So name equals name equals, and then we'll have the uh, single quotes and we'll say personality like that. And like it said, it's not going to do anything to it, but it will uh, be useful when we fool around with the servers, right? So let's uh, check the code, looks good, and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 58, and we'll see you next time.